Jackie. I am, however, a violent and highly dangerous escape criminal madman. <laughs> hey, what would you like us to do? Let's <laughs> right, um, everybody, um, everybody up against this wall. No! He says, nobody move and nothing will happen. How are we going to get through the wall if we can't move? <laughs> and to the point, what happens if we do move to the wall? Hey? Oh, God, look, what happens if anybody moves? <laughs> what happens? Yes! Oh, right, well, I'm terribly sorry, terribly sorry, right, right. Now, if anybody moves, right, I'll show you what happens, right? This happens, right? <laughs> oh, hi, man, are you the doctor? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, 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 hey, I think that's done the trick. <laughs> Thanks, Doc. Thanks, Doc. Are you being sarcastic or something, my son? <laughs> that's one of my least favourite things that happens to be sarcasm. Well, eh. <sighs> How incredibly interesting. I was walking the dog, right? And this bloke, he comes up to me and he says, Nice day, innit? <laughs> but it wasn't. It wasn't a nice day. It was a little bit cloudy, which makes him very sarcastic. So acting as if nothing could happen, right, I got his head, right, I stuck it in my mouth, right, acting dead casual like, I closed <laughs> my teeth, right, and bit his head off! Cos I hate people being sarcastic. Yeah, well, I, I wasn't, you know, being, being sarcastic. <laughs> Wouldn't ya? No. I'll forget everything I just said then, all right? <laughs> but everything from when you first came in. Now, if you don't get up against that wall, by the time I count three, I'm going to blow your heads off one by one. All right? Our one. Our two. Oh, God! Sorry, Lock and Lock, love. Some joker's impaled a head on the front door. Hello, Vivian. Piss off! <laughs> That's no way to talk to your mother, Vivian. All right, then. Piss off, Mum. <laughs> That's better. What do you want? <laughs> Well, what are mums for? I don't know, having babies. <laughs> don't be so sexist, Vivian. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Mum. No, I heard you was ill, so I brought you a present. Last present you gave me was a box of matches. That was a joke. I was only eight weeks old. <laughs> here, here, excuse me, excuse me. I'm not actually known for my patience. <laughs> oh, oh, well, you're probably not Dr Kildare, then. <laughs> Raw meat this time. A bottle of vodka. Oh, brilliant! Thanks, Mum! <laughs> this is empty. Ha <laughs> I'm yours, ugly! <laughs> cool. What a nasty woman. <laughs> uh, all right! This has now gone on far too seriously long enough by half, OK? <laughs> I am now going to phone the authorities, right? And if they do not give me, within 20 minutes, a helicopter, a hundred thousand pounds, a complete set of steak knives <laughs> in a presentation box, seven tickets to see the Brazilian National Mime Theatre at the Riverside Studios, a little can terrier called Bobby, one of them, one of them little black rubber things, one of them little black rubber things, the ones that go nick, 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 nick. Yeah, big box full of them, right? Um, the complete memoirs of Donald Sindon. Ah, um, oh, very handy! Otherwise, I'm going to blow your heads off, all right? <laughs> now, everybody, up against that wall, now! Right, all right. Oh, no! Lummy, lummy! All right, who's responsible? Well, I think I'm quite responsible, actually. Yeah, Mike is, yeah. Listen, listen! Somebody has got to clear all this muck up! And I can tell you one thing, matey boy, it's not going to be me. <laughs> now, what does a villain must matter? We're all going to be dead in 20 minutes anyway. Yeah. Oh, no! Oh, well! Oh, heavy, heavy, heavy! Oh. What are you upset for? You've always wanted to die. Who's talking about dying? I just remembered. My parents are coming round to tea! <laughs> don't panic! Don't panic! Worst things happen at sea. Like what, Mike? Like what? All right, you could be on a nice cruise in the South China Sea, having a lovely time. There's terrible weather, a big storm, and the ship sinks, you fall overboard, you're drowning. This big shark swims up to you, opens his mouth, he says, by the way, Neil's parents are coming to tea in 30 seconds. That's when you panic. Yeah. Come on! <laughs> Thing. 
Queen of Corridor. Aye. All hail, McVivian, Thane of the outside toilet, and that little gravelly patch next to the garden shed. <laughs> All hail, McVivian, that shall be king of the whole house hereafter. Are you suggesting that I murder Mike, Rick, and Neil in order to have the whole house to myself? Yeah! It's a thought, I suppose. <laughs> Make a great play! 27, 28, 29. Look out! Hello, Mommy. Hello. 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 Oh. Take my coat, please. Come in. This is my house where I live. Oh. Oh. These are my friends. This is Rick. He's studying sociology. Oh. Hello. Pleased to meet you. <laughs> Sorry. Essays to write. <laughs> I'm surprised my arms aren't falling off. Perhaps they are. Look out! Boom! <laughs> uh, you have to look out for me because I'm a bit nutty. Aren't I, everybody? A bit nutty. <laughs> Hello. Oh, and uh, this is Mike. He's studying. Uh, um... Well, I'm in what you'd call the school of life, Mrs. Pine. <laughs> oh, dear, Neil, what a, what a ghastly smell. Yeah, uh, that's Vivian, Mummy. <laughs> He's going to be a doctor. <laughs> How do you do? Oh, fascinating. <laughs> I think I'm going to be sick. <laughs> Is this fellow another of your colleagues? Oh, no, uh, that's the most violent and highly dangerous... <laughs> that's Neil's little joke, sir. <laughs> Brian, Brian Damage, are currently working on my uh, PhD in uh, astrophysics, actually. Uh, <laughs> but uh, recently I did uh, work on a degree in art history, but uh, it was no use for a job, you well, know. What kind of a job had you in mind? Oh, something like a bank job, you know. <laughs> nice, safe job. Yeah, possibly, possibly. <laughs> Your bed. No, no, I bought it. Uh, <laughs> exactly. 